Oh, that's right. We unlocked this character in the last episode because we've been exploring the forest. So, we've made a little bit of progress. I don't remember. I'm trying to remember how much of this is on Twitch, how much of this is on YouTube, where it's at. Because Spelunky is such a weird game, but it makes sense because it's so random. So, if you recall, we used to go this way. And there was a sign here that said construction. Well, we saved the tunnel man, we gave him all the things he wanted, and now he has a passageway for the forest. So we can just play the forest if we want to. We can practice the forest. But I don't want to do that. I want to try and go for full runs here on YouTube.com. Hold on, I need to take off my hat. Okay. See how good we're getting? See how much better we've gotten? It really is one of those games where you can track your progression, your skill progression. And I appreciate that about it. Okay, we're going this way. Oh, we should have looked down, but I can see the ground right there. I hear the pug. Okay, I see a trap. What else is... Oh, okay, there's the pug. We don't need to mess with, this, with the snakes at all. Let's break up all these spider webs so that we can grab our dude. Come on, little buddy. Look down. Aha, tried to be tricky there, Derek. I see you. Okay. Hey, what do you what do you know, man? One one zero with no damage and a heart. It's like we're practicing this game or something. It's like I've been playing it. The more you play it, the the better you get. And in that sense, I see why people say, "Damn near a perfect game." It's just so freaking hard. Okay, there's a spider up there. I don't need any of that. Is there any reason for me to do this? There's a shop underneath me in there. Screw it. He's gonna he's gonna be mad, yeah, I know. Oh god, he hit the spikes. Wait a second. He's got a shoddy, let's go. Okay, hold on, wait a second here. Whoa! Okay, careful. Don't get don't get crazy just because he killed the shopkeep. Come on now. <laughs> that worked out in our favor. Let's go, dude. I think this might be the run. Although, you know, you never know. I think this thing just has infinite ammo, if I'm not mistaken. As long as I don't lose it, I just have ammo. I need to remember to look for the damsels. I lost a health back there. All right. Oh, freaking arrow traps. Ow! No, I didn't mean to climb down the ladder. I was trying to crouch. Well, too late now. Oh, there's a key there. You know what? I don't want the eye. I don't care about the eye right now. But here's what I was trying to do. It. That doesn't help me at all. That doesn't help me at all. Oh my good lord. I've been screwed by fate right now. Will this work? I don't know. Okay, thank god. Oh shit. Ah, dude. So none of this mattered. 
Oh, and that's gonna go off. God damn it. <sighs> I gotta waste the rope. No! Oh, I was not counting on the shotgun knockback. <laughs> so yeah, welcome back to Spelunky, everybody. My name is Gummy Worm Jim. Um, this game is interesting as all hell. Very cool. I do see now why people talk about the game design of this as though it were like, oh! God damn it, as though it were like some holy grail of video gaming because it really does have a lot of really interesting mechanics to it. Coming down here. I meant to jump right on you. I'm doing bad right now. Hold on, this is this is a bad run. Okay, there's our life point. Alright, we'll go back to three and start it up. Was that one one? Alright. <laughs> Not doing as good as we could be doing, but... Ow, come on, really? Alright, watch out for all these gray blocks, because any one of them could be an arrow trap. Oh, just straight up no. Oh, okay. Once you break the spider webs, it kind of works. Okay, I am also going to need to hurry up because there is a ghost coming. Oh, and a giant spider. Fun. Oh, hell yeah. Arrow trap for the win. Come here, bruh. Sexy as hell. <laughs> All right. I only have 6,000. Check this out, though. Mine. <laughs> I'll take the shoddy. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, that's how you do it. Machete is all it takes, man. If you can get the machete and the shopkeeper is not... Because he, once he gets, like, wise to you, he'll start putting himself up in a window. So you gotta make sure <laughs> the shopkeep counts as a kill. Of course. You'll pay for your crimes? Oh, they're just mad at me in general now? That sucks. Bruh. Ow! Bro, you gotta chill. Oh no, I'm not gonna be able to get through there. Maybe not. Maybe I am. Nope. <laughs> not when he's that mad. Oh my goodness. Never should have angered that shopkeeper. I didn't know he was gonna wait for me in other rooms. Cause I killed one. They got the they got wise to me, is what it was. I don't want that to go off while I'm here. Rusty rock. Oh, it almost hit me. Okay, there's got to be a damsel somewhere near here, right? Got to be. Oop. Yeah, I know where the exit is. I'm just wondering where the damsel went. 
I need that sweet kiss, you know what I'm saying? Oh, I could at least grab that. Well, all right. We'll look for the damsel in the next room. So yeah, the thing that's interesting about it is I, I started thinking about what Derek was saying in this documentary I watched where he was talking about how much, like, the, the things that actually do make this like the game Rogue that he liked, which is that items are so multi-use, it's not just, like, pick up a rock and throw it, or pick up a, you know, pick up a, a person and carry them to the exit. Okay, I don't need any of this, I don't think. Mystery box? I don't, I don't have enough. You suck, dude. Ow! Oh! Oh! Right onto the spikes. <laughs> <coughs> okay, all right, all right, all right, all right, for real. No. Look at that greed trap, that's just rude. They're like, hey, don't you want this gem? You'll have to die for it. Or figure it out like a G. Watch me do, watch me do. Hold on, wait. No, it just doesn't work. It doesn't work on the ladder. Perfect. Not even gonna mess with that level. <laughs> hey, buddy. Now I really need you because I lost one. Okay, what is that? Room Was that room two? Nope, that's room one. Okay. That's right, because we died to the spikes. All right, room one. Done. Room two. Why, hi, Derek, why? Why are these arrow traps like this? Why are they so everywhere? Oh, good lord. Oh. No damsel though, huh? All right, that's all right, that's okay. We still got four lives and we got through room two. That's pretty good in my book. Four health, four health. We got four health. Oh, what a wealth. Four health, four health. Oh shit, there was another trap over there that I didn't see. That's fucked up. That's fucked up, dude. This is a widescreen game already. There's no reason. There's no reason shit should be going off to the to the lateral sides that I don't see. Oh, I gotta keep wasting bombs on this shit. Because it's the only thing... Oh! I could have just looked and I would have seen that the arrow is right here. God damn it. Oh, that's easy though. Okay, now what am I doing? I only have one bomb left. I got four ropes, though. D 
damn it. Fuck. Almost, it's not quite. Okay, so that's the pit. I have one bomb, I need to use it really wisely here. I think this is it. This might be the play, this might not be the play though. Fuck, it was not the play. Ah, uh, dude, all right. Figure this out before the ghost comes, hopefully. Oh, it's right here. Come on now. Oh, big spider. Oh, oh my god, that was too close. Uh, okay. Woo. One, three, complete. Let's go. Last one, last room for the mines. Can we do it? Oh, we only have one health. Not looking great. No. Nope. There it, there, it, there it is. There it goes. We have to get through the mines. Like, we have to get to the point where... Because the, the whole point is, like, right, we unlock the forest. We can go to the forest if we want to. But, first of all, it doesn't count towards, like, a full run. A full run is from the mine to the end. I'm assuming... I think you beat Olmec or something, right? If you're not going from the mine to the end, then you're not doing a full run. No point. Gotta be careful with those skeletons. Okay, thanks Block for setting off the trap. Can we... There we go, that's nice. Um, how do we get out of here, though? All right, we have some bombs. We have some bombs. We should be able to do this a little. Oh, I see her. We might not have enough bombs from this level. Let's go to the next level. Next level down. Damn it, there's a double block. Why would they do this to us? Okay. I think I see the weak point. Maybe. I still have not gotten to the point where I'm getting screwed by the ghost. Wait, where is she? She was right here. Oh, she's right there. Oh my god, this is not going to work. She's just too far in there. Shit. Alright, I gotta go. I'm going to get eaten by the ghost. <sighs> well, we tried. Sometimes it's chicken, sometimes it's feathers. That time, it, she was just way too... Way too locked up in the soil. God damn it. Okay. God damn it. How do you not get hit by that when you swing at it? This is just not made for that. Uh, what do spike boots do? What the? Oh no, there's a sacrifice thing right here. Where's the door? Where's the way to get out? I don't want to sacrifice my buddy. I want to, I want to use him as life. Uh, 
and I will take the rope because the boomerang I feel like is worth it. Although if we get to the uh, forest, it's like basically not worth it because you can have you can just have a boomerang. Okay. One two complete. Let's see. See how useful the boomerang has been already? And the fact that it comes back to you or gets stuck somewhere. Oh no, that's not what I thought it was. I thought it was a way out. Oh my God, that was traumatizing. Okay, we gotta watch out for this caveman. That was great. That was actually a decent little run, although I think we lost some health. One, three, complete. Last, last uh, room for the mines. Oh, it's a snake pit. Okay. Watch out for the snake pit. But you do want to get to the bottom of it, because usually there's good stuff in the snake pit. Last rope. Oh, that might not be worth it at all. Haha, uh -huh, you're stuck in there. Or at least I hope you're stuck in there. And it doesn't matter. <laughs> Good lord. This game is so chaotic. Alright, one more run. Let's go. Nope. Dude. Maybe this isn't the run. Ow! Well, the good thing is that the uh, iframes from the arrow, I think, blocked our fall damage, which is... We took two, but we negated one. More ropes! for the arrow traps. They're literally everywhere. <sighs> Thank you. All right, that gives us two health to get through world two or room two. Get back here, snake. It's so interesting that you can walk through the spikes, but you can't, uh, can't land on them. Maybe? I don't know if we have enough bombs to get here, but we'll see. What is, what is your deal, lady? Oh, no, yeah, we can, we can get you. All right, so now we're back up to three health for room three. Now if we can get one more, we're back up to full health. And I'll hopefully not, you know, take damage. You know what to, you know what I'm trying to do. <laughs> and see you playing games with my emotions. Watch out, it's gonna fall. 
At least I think it's gonna fall. Maybe it's not. Oh yeah! Die, die, just die. Stop. Yeah, don't have the, I don't want the birds on your head anymore. Oh, ow. Eat him. <laughs> eat this guy. Don't eat me. <laughs> Last room. All right, can we survive? So it really comes down to just playing very smart, which I shouldn't even say. I shouldn't even say that kind of shit out loud when I'm about to go into a run. So anyway, that's Spelunky. Um, maybe in the next one we'll just practice the forest or something. I don't know.